It's just been the most rewarding thing I've ever done. We got to meet so many new people, make lots of new friends. The confidence that you gain from doing extracurricular stuff means that you're more confident with your course and your own ability. Getting involved in all those things really makes you stand out. And being able to look back and thinking, wow, I've achieved a lot. During my time at York, I decided to um, start volunteering with Minds in Motion. We hold social and recreational events for people in the local community who are affected by dementia. It includes all the sort of logistics like um, booking venues, inviting guests and recruiting and organising student volunteers to help run the session. PEN is um, a student society which is part of a larger organisation um, that's international and it stands for poets, essayists and novelists. Through PEN we invite loads of guest speakers and it's a really good chance to network with people from lots of different businesses and students and making the most of our connections. I got involved in WISE because I started getting interested in teaching. It was more than that, this was like a whole experience really of being a teaching assistant, helping these children. You make a difference. NICEF is a um, nighttime sort of safety scheme. It was quite exciting. There was, for me personally, the opportunity to get really hands-on and really mould it into the kind of direction I wanted to take it in. So at university I've been on two at work projects, a series of workshops for school children and one which was creating a book selling report for the bookshops in York. We got to create something really professional. For the last 12 months I was president of the Women's Football Club here at York. While doing that I was also an ambassador for Marie Curie and York hosted the inaugural Women's Football Festival. It was great to be able to showcase York on a national scale, show off my club a bit and they were all very happy about the work that we were doing. My entrepreneurial activities at York really started when I had a business idea and that was something called Rate My Uni House, an online platform where you can log on and rate your student house. So almost like TripAdvisor but for student property. Daylaw is um, a living history centre. It focuses on taking children back to what it would be like being a Viking or a Roman and then I went back at the beginning of second year and haven't left yet. <laughs> I'd always been told to get involved in societies and volunteering and just everything university had to offer. Um, and by doing that, um, I've actually realised that working for charities, that's really my calling, that's what I want to be doing in the future. Taking part in WISES helped me a lot. I thought, I'll give it a shot and I can say, I love it. It's just invaluable. You get to improve your confidence so much more. I've made a whole new group of friends and contacts. I've managed to do lots of public speaking and create things that I didn't think I'd be able to. I've had so many experiences in York to get involved in and I think that's really helped me stand out from the crowds, whether it's on a collegiate level through being a chair or sport at university level with hockey. Just getting involved in all those things really makes you stand out as a candidate. I think the key highlight of my extracurricular experience was um, being nominated for the Best of Alternative Student Media by Huffington Post, um, which I think really rewarded the team for their hard work this year. The confidence that you gain from doing extracurricular stuff outside of your degree just means that you're more confident with your course and your own ability. Nightsafe has shown me how, how much I enjoy project management, so I've kind of thought that that must be where I want to go with my career. I've just got involved with everything and being able to look back through York Award and thinking, wow, I've achieved a lot, I've improved like my degree skills and my personal skills, everything has improved so much. I was planning on becoming a teacher, so things like day law and guiding are really good for that. Especially at day law, every day is something different. Being able to stand in front of 60 kids and get them all to listen to me, I think is quite an achievement. It's all about becoming a well-rounded person and getting that life experience about becoming a grown-up proving to yourself as well as to future employers that you've really got the most out of the university experience and um, so yeah I definitely recommend it. My number one piece of advice for a fresher is to get involved in as many societies as possible and to make best use of all the work experience placements from the careers department and only by doing all of those will you find out exactly what you want to do.